Hold on one second. Just one second. Hold on. And say cheese. All right. You guys are now saved on my phone forever. That means you guys got to stick around. All right, y'all, let me stop playing. What's up, y'all? Welcome back. Thanks for clicking on the video first off to every single one of y'all. If it's y'all first time, I appreciate that. If it's y'all second time, welcome back. If it's y'all third time, I guess you will also get a welcome back, right? Either way, what's up, y'all? Thanks for clicking on the video. Thanks for giving me a shot. First, second, third, fourth, fifth time coming back. Technically, it could only be the third time coming back because I've only uploaded three videos. But don't tell nobody I said that. All right, uh, let's just get straight into it, right? We're in for a good time tonight because here's why. I am playing a game called The Stalked. This game is a demo, though it's not a big game. But before then, I just want to reassure y'all, this game does look interesting. And I've said that about every single game I've played in the past. But y'all know how I am. Or you don't, because this might be your first time. Y'all are probably like, bro, stop talking to us already. Play the game. I got y'all. But before then, y'all know how I work. Or don't, because it's your first time. How I work is I got to tell y'all the plot. Let me tell you the plot right now. Here's the plot. The game is called The Stalked, a demo. The Stalked is a single player horror game about a woman being stalked. Here's the story. You play as Kate, who has recently broken up with her obsessive boyfriend, Liam. However, Liam isn't willing to let her go so easily. After numerous struggles, Kate manages to escape and calls her grandpa for help. Fortunately, he offers her refuge in a mansion. You might think that's the end of the story, but it's only the beginning. Strange and creepy occurrences unfold around the mansion, making Kate question if Liam has found her or if there's something else involved. What do the mysterious letters mean? And will she ever find peace? Right. So first off, automatically, creepy ass position to be in, right? If y'all have an obsessive boyfriend, I pray for y'all. Try to get out of there. Because an obsessive crazy boyfriend is crazy. If y'all, y'all got to leave him. Y'all got to leave him. Stop. This is your sign. If you clicked on my video out of everybody's video, you got to leave him. This is your sign. Yo, I might be the reason for some people's breakup. All right, take that off my mind. <laughs> well, we might as well just, let's just get straight into the game. You know what I'm saying? Let's just get straight into it. I'll meet y'all in the game. I'll meet y'all then. Y'all getting, are y'all getting, y'all getting like sad? <laughs> First off, magical fingers. Whoever was on this piano, magical fingers. This man automatically makes me want to cry. I'm feeling vulnerable right now. And I got, it don't help that I got, I got. I'm staring into her eyes to to know her name right I'm, I'm like staring i'm figuring out her name through her pupils alone her name is what was her name chat oh her name was kate first off kate needs to do a to, to take one quick second adapt her situational awareness just turn around real quick kate he's right behind you that's how you'll know if you're being stalked or not <laughs> all right let's get into it y'all let's get it going kate Good thing is there's no chasing. Y'all know I don't like chasing. Ah. My water attacked me. I had to break up with Liam and I hope he takes it well. I don't know, hopefully he, hopefully he does. Ah, God. Okay, so that's the front door. Go straight into like a little patio with a little balcony, a little fireplace. Ooh, I walk, I walk really weird though. I'm not gonna lie. Relatable though. Like I need to make some food. I'm hungry. Facts. All right, let's go make some food. Yo, nice pictures, nice paint. Yo, this actually, high key. The marble floors is kind of crazy though. That's like, that's like rich. That's like talking rich. All right, let's make some food. But before then, we gotta explore real quick. Get, get, get. Aware with our surroundings. Big TV. Yo, what can we watch on here, bro? What are we watching? Put your body on the party because it's party time. Party time. Gotta get down low. Yeah. It's party time just to let it go. <laughs> it's party time. Yeah, go with the flow. Yeah. 
It's party, party time. You can do it, I know. Yeah. Party. My happy show. I don't know what was on there, yo. I don't, I won't know till later. Yeah, Haiki, is this is this kind of is this kind of um weird to say? But you know you mad rich when you get in paintings and and picture frames of just of just leaves and and feathers, right? Is that is that weird to say? Okay. And this stuff. Let's keep it moving. Let's go make something to eat. Or you can run. I hate that. You know what running means. Let's check it around. Maybe we open the oven. Start the start the the stove. Oh, there you go. Boom. Ooh, bet. Pick that John up. Put it. Oh, we we cooking cookings. Turn that John on. Oh, this is detailed too. The pan look mad exactly like a pan would look. Okay, turn that John on. Get some ingredients. Yep. Boom. Organic food. That was all in the can. Who will be knocking on my door at this hour? It's a good question. Hold on, turn turn this on down real quick though, just so just to make sure we're not dying. Hello. Oh, leave that open just in case I gotta run in here. Who is it? Oh, and y'all don't got a peephole in a rich house? Who's there? Liam. Hey, honey. Can I come in? Ugh. Liam, I told you it's over. So no, you can't come in. Come on, you can't just leave me like that. I love you more than anything. It's over, Liam. Just go home. Open the door, Kate. I'm not opening the door. I don't love you anymore. You will be mine again soon. Sounded like he walked away. Thank God. Food should be ready now. So yeah, he does know where we at. All right, let's go get my food. I don't want that John burned just because my freaking eggs. Turn that John down real quick. That John high key look good too. If that's what it looked like and that's what it sounded like, I don't know how good that was then, bro. I'm not gonna lie. A bath right now would sound really nice though. A good, mm, a good meal. Look at this bathroom, y'all. No mirror is kind of crazy though. Or is that like not rich people things? Do rich people not have mirrors? No, I doubt. I feel like they. What was that? Uh, um. So good thing we haven't taken off any clothes. Hello. No, that motherfucker threw a rock. He threw a rock through my window, bro. What is that? And a strange bag. I wasn't sure about this thing. It looked like drugs they show in movies. They hid it in my bag. I flushed them Johns down the toilet. Okay, at, at least we know that we're like high up. Like we're in the city. We're like all the way up here. So we don't got to worry about people coming through our balcony. Like I thought that was like a backyard, but it was our balcony. Bro, but where he throw it from? This guy got good aim. Wait, nah, bro. This man must have been on that side, on that, on that building. How'd he get up there? He's obsessed. He's obsessed. Okay, let me look at it. Yo, because from him to throw it from down there, below us, all the way up here, and hit this door, and to get it in, he has to, oh, we dated a football player. Got you. Give me another chance, please. Yo, y'all heard that? Unless that was this door. So, some door opened, bro. I will treat you well and do anything you want. I promise. Just one chance is all I ask. That can't be too much, can it? XOXO Liam. No, no, no. I gotta leave before he does something worse. Oh, this isn't my... Oh, this isn't my dad's apartment. I mean, this isn't my dad's mansion. This is our apartment. Oh, okay. So I'm just so poor that I thought this this was this was rich life. Okay. <laughs> so we better... 
That wasn't open, was it? I swear I heard a door open, and I don't think. <laughs> Excuse me? First off, that man scared the shit out of me. Where was he at? He was hiding. This man is crazy. What the fuck? There's, there's, it's a, you have to dump the What did he say? There's, there's, it's a, you have to dump the He ran through the counter. He ran through. I was ready to run, but I didn't expect, I didn't expect him to go through the counter, bruh. I would have tried to put up a fight. Like, I would have tried to run around the counter like seven times. Man ran straight through it. First off, second off, third off. Yo, this game just caught me by surprise. There was a shopping list. How did I die so early? Where am I supposed to go? Am I supposed to leave the house? There's so many questions. <laughs> we might as well try again, yo. My fault. You scared the shit out of me, bro. Calm down. Gather yourself. Ask the right questions. I heard him. Saw the door. I didn't expect him to be behind the counter. That shit scared the fuck out of me, bro. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, let's try again, bro. Okay, I see that the door is open. I guess I run out the door. Is that him over there? No, that's a vase. I'm not even waiting. I know he's back there. There's no point in me angering him. <clears throat> Kate, I have a strong feeling and urge. You should not do that. Good thing no stamina bar. Look at his head. Look at his head. Liam. I see you, Liam. Liam, you can show yourself now. I see I see the top of your head. You gotta switch shampoos, Liam. <clears throat> nope. Oh my. I was not, y'all, y'all. I was not sitting there and watching him chase me. I'm booking it out. Ooh. Nice little car. Please. Where's he at? Any, anything? Okay, I'll make sure the door's locked. Pick up her phone. <sighs> Swipe up to unlock. Calling my grandpa. Yo, Gramps. Gramps, please pick up, bro. Hey, grandpa. I need your help. Hey, Kate. What's going on? Liam broke into my apartment and chased me. I barely got away. And now I'm in my car. I got nowhere to go. That's horrible. Are, are you okay? Did, did he hurt some? Did he hurt you? No, I got away before he could do something, but I'm terrified he'll find me. Okay, I assume you're looking for a place to stay for a while? Yeah, Grandpa, yes. Yes, I need somewhere to go quickly. I own a mansion above. Wait, I own a mansion about an hour, a couple hours drive from the city. It should be empty for a couple of weeks now. Great, thanks, Grandpa. Can I go there right now? Yes, I'll send you the address and the key to the mansion in the basement. Okay, thanks again, Grandpa. You're a lifesaver. Literally, Grandpa. Damn. No problem. I hope all goes well. And don't hesitate to call me again. Oh, oh my god. Yo, you dated this guy, bro? You dated this guy? You... Drive off, yo. Close that door. Why was it your door locked? Yo, if you see him running across the street, bro, run him over, bro. That man's was zooted too, yo. That man's was off some type of. He was off some, bro. Off the fan or some. Liam won't be able to find me anymore. I have finally broken free from that toxic relationship. Get out of there, y'all. It's y'all sign. Okay. This is a self driving car, because notice how the, the steering wheel ain't moving. Yo, first off, shout out to Gramps, bro. And first off, second off. There's no way Liam is uh, is here, bro. I'm getting too paranoid now. Of course it's not him. Probably just a neighbor. Do you not know Liam's car? How long have you been dating Liam? Like, y'all, you should know his car by now. What I was going to say is, first off, shout out to Grandpa. Secondly. Secondly, yo, how, yo, how rich is Grandpa? How rich are you? You must have been rich to own an apartment like that, that high up. With, how, with marble flooring like that. I thought that was the mansion. I'm poor. Boy, let's get a let's get a nice good look at the house. Yo, this is a big house, bro. 17 rooms at least. Knock knock. 
Grandpa said that the key was in the basement, right? I'm over here thinking Slender Man in the forest, bro. All right, on to the basement, yo. We'll present our phone, bro, because I don't want my phone to die. And the basement is just open? Y'all not worried about anything coming down here? There's a coffin down here. I don't want to step foot into this god dang god. I don't want to step foot into this basement. What is flickering, bro? A light is flickering. Is this not on? You said this house was empty, right? What did your grandpa do for a living, bro? I can't walk around this pole, goddammit. Oh my god. He was a... A freak. <laughs> There's a key. I'm locked. Bro, the thing is, I don't know. Like, I guess that might just be the heater or something. Put your guard up. Expect some. Oof. Oh my gosh. Y'all gotta understand, yo. This is actually terrifying, bro. He's doing a great job at setting... Setting the environment, bro. Because I'm terrified just walking around. Like, I didn't even expect Liam to pop in front of the window. Even though, even though I kind of did. That's why I wanted to lock the doors. The fact that he did it and it scared me just was terrifying. We got the we got the key. Let's open up. Yo, how, high key? A mansion at this time? No lights? It's terrifying. Hello? Wow, it's dark in here. Let's turn off some lights and find a bedroom. I want to hit the bed ASAP. I'm stressed. I gotta log in for y'all though. Let's turn on the lights, y'all. Yeah? Let's turn on the lights. Light switch. Boom. All right. Um. Okay. So this is uh. If we look to our left here, we will see a dining room, kitchen, living room, uh, everything room because this is a mansion. I think it's just the kitchen. I think it's the kitchen or the dining room. All right. It's not. It's not really that bright in here. I hope that they rely on uh, natural lighting. Oh, it's Jesus Christ. Please protect us. Was that open? Am I not paying attention, y'all? <clears throat> I'm guessing it was open because I can't close it. I might have just not been able to. I just might not have peeped it. What's in here? Okay, that's a just a separate Separate room with something block in the back. I will be back for that. I can still run Which is never a good sign Oh the bathroom looks wonderful Oh, it looks amazing I can't wait It's a bathroom in here. Do bathroom things. That's outside. We have two doors. God, everything's so scary, bro. All right, all right, let's just check in here real quick. This might just be an empty room. Yeah. It's just an empty room. You know what I'm thinking, y'all? Ooh, I see an axe, bro. I'm thinking, yo, we're gonna have to come in here and hide here for some reason. Like, I'm thinking, like, we're gonna have to hide. I'm see I'm peeping that axe, though. Like, can I not? I'm sleeping with that, bro. I'm sleeping with that next to me, under my pillow. Let's just go upstairs, y'all. Turn on. We turned on the lights. It's time to go upstairs. Hmm. I feel so I feel so comfy and nice. Y'all don't understand how terrified I am right now, bro. I'm actually so scared. Mmm, what a beautiful view. Hello. I heard there was supposed to be no one in here. Seems as though there's not. 
Ooh, that uh, couch is missing a little little leg there. Who's working here, bruh? This is like a little workspace. Okay, just to do your grown-up things. Let's check over here real quick. Anything over here? Nope, just a just a lounge area, just to have another one. You know, just in case you know what I'm saying. Just in case you want to lounge around again after you already lounged in every other room. Ah, oh, the bedroom. How how welcoming and bright. Ah yes. Let's let's head on to sleep now. Why does that sound like a knock every time I close the door? And it is. Oh, it's only like 9:35. You said 9:35? Bro, it is 3 a.m. Okay, it's well, it's 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 like 3:35, almost 3:40, right? I know how to tell time, y'all. Stop, 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 stop. Let's just head on to bed. Let's just head on to bed. Let's get one quick little glance. Make sure Liam ain't there. All right, let's have a. Let's have a good night, y'all. Let's have a good night. Daytime. Y'all, we made it. Oh my gosh, this game, this this house looks so much more welcoming and awesome. I better go check the door. It could be Grandpa who's out to visit me. Check the window. All right, let's go check the door. Yo, for, I mean, like, this is like a really old mansion, so I'm guessing like it's not too much modernism going on around here. Like this was like this is what rich people had. I keep just this many rooms in general though is like kind of crazy. But like this is like a carpet you'd see in like an average home. I think. I mean, not in my home. Let's keep it going. Oh, and another one. And an that's why it's rich, because he got seven of them. Now right, let's go check the door. It's so much more nice and inviting and welcoming when it's daytime. They definitely do rely on natural light. That's why all the windows are open. Hello? Who is it? Oh. The mailman. How, how kind of him to drop the letter. Dearest new resident of this mansion. I am the previous owner of this mansion, and you are the person I have been looking for. I hope to see you stick around for a while. I'm sure we'll get along just fine. I will be watching you. How kind, neighbors. They're so nice. What kind of joke is this? I can't be bothered to deal with some stupid teenagers right now. Well, I better get going to the convenience store now before it gets dark. That's true. Get some groceries, that way we can do some cooking, that way we don't go starving. Some food in the can will be nice. Meals ready to eat. Y'all ever seen that? Y'all ever seen that show? Called the I think it's called The Watcher, which is pretty much almost exactly it's it's not like a crazy ex. But they move into like a new mansion and then it's like the neighborhood gives them letters. Or like some random person gives them a letter saying that he's watching. Maybe that's what this is based off of. Press tab to look at the shopping list. Hey, canned food, uh, snacks, soda, milk, cereal, wine. Hey, some wine to calm down. Yo, look at the environment, y'all. So pink and dusty, but high key soothing. All right, we got the cashier and this guy at the ATM. Oh, it's automatic doors. What up, y'all? Hey, man. How you doing, man? How you doing, all right? I'm just gonna do some shopping. Before I step foot in, in front of this guy, I'm gonna just let's get some canned food, right? Ooh, some wine off rip. So let's talk to the cashier. Let's be nice for once. Yo, bro. This guy got a beard with a braid in it. This guy's cool. Yo, this guy's actually sick. What's up, man? Anyway, how about you, Doc? Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Excuse me, sir. Oh, hi there. I haven't seen you around here before. Are you new? Yeah, I just moved in. Oh, where do you live? <laughs> I don't feel comfortable telling you that yet. Are you alone? Um, I'm in a hurry. I gotta go. Look at this man's eyes, y'all. He's staring into our souls. All right. Um, let's get some food. <laughs> Sir, I hate to tell you this, but somehow your mirror isn't working. <clears throat> All right, bro, let's get some food. Do I need to have my it out? Oh, there is an arrow. Okay. All right, on the snacks, on to snacks. Yep, over here. Some chips. Hoi. Hold on, let's see what car he gets in, y'all. Don't be, don't be suspicious.
Better not step foot in my car. Yep, he would go in the van, bruh. Don't be suspicious, y'all. Let's keep shopping, y'all. Let's keep an eye on him, though. All right, milk. Maybe over here. Anywhere over here. There it is. Oh, carton milk. All right. Hey, 3.5% calcium. Why hasn't he left yet, bro? Is he watching me? I don't like that. Cereal. Let's get some cereal. And some wine. It's a good old wine. Just to, just to chillax. Who's that? That's all. Let's go pay for this now. Hey, sir. I like your beard, man. That shit's dope. A little beautiful. Is that all? Yeah, that's about it. All right. The total is twenty-eight fifty. Thank you for shopping here. Also, I can tell you're new to the area. How long do you stand for? Eh, it's no problem. Uh, I'm not too sure yet. Not too long, I would assume. Oof. You had to throw him in there like that? Like, couldn't pass me? All right. Have a good day. And here's your groceries. Thanks. You too. Had to pop a you for the one time just in case. Yo, if I'm being honest, bro, this... That guy was that, that guy was suspicious and he's still in a van. Can you Can you watch me while I go to my car? <laughs> Thank you, sir. Alright. See you, man. I'll be back around again. Nice beard, by the way, dude. That shit was sick, dude. Okay, this guy doesn't have a shattered window. Look at his license plate, y'all. ADL 468 Oh my Jesus Christ, dude. Can you stop staring at me like that? My gosh, bro, fix your face. You know, a young, beautiful lady like you shouldn't be walking out alone like this. I know, bro. What do you want, dude? Like, what the fuck you running at me for? I do have some wishes, but I think it's best they remain unspoken. Bro, look how worried and unfazed he looks. Y'all gotta be quiet, though. But even if y'all still was quiet, he'd hear y'all. Look at his ears, y'all. Be careful. And don't let me catch you all alone again. I don't need your warnings, dude. Respect my space and stay away, you freak. Look at his hands, too. What a weird place I'm in right now. Bunch of weirdos. He called me beautiful, though. <clears throat> and it's nighttime. It took, that, it took that long? It took that long to get groceries? Put your flashlight out, yo. And that guy was in a weird blue car. Let me let me make sure, bruh. I'm doing I'm doing a sweep. I'm doing a sweep around the house. Gotta make sure we're not being followed or nothing, bruh. Secondly, close that basement door. Cause you don't know what's going on around here, bro. Thirdly, get that axe and keep it with you at all times. Yo, I'm I'm actually I'm actually genuinely terrified right now. I'ma go through the side. You know why? Because I know that there's a light switch right here. Damn, and I did keep all the doors open. So now I don't know if there's anybody in them. <clears throat> Y'all, I'm scared. I think the power's out, dude. Click this on. Great. Bro, welcome home. You look beautiful in the store today. Aw, oh, hell no, bro. Can't wait to see you again. Who is this guy? Who is he, bro? Getting closer.
Yo, the way I am actually so terrified right now is absolutely insane. I'm I'm not opening that door. Call me a pussy. This bathroom is where I stay at. I can I was gonna say I can eat here. But the only thing I can do is piss and I'm fine with that. And I can shit. Bro, imagine if this was grandpa the whole time, like just pranking you. Bro, but did y'all not hear that like the door opening in that room? But then it also sounded like he was walking over there, bro. My headset's not backwards. I gotta step out, bro. I gotta I gotta come out. Do I go upstairs? It sounded like he knocked. But the thing is upstairs, y'all, if y'all go upstairs, y'all gotta come back down eventually. It's like if you go upstairs, you either gotta fight or you gotta hide really good. I'm smacking him in his face, bro. Did they expect me to go to the front door? Cause excuse me, no sir. I'm gonna have to go to the front door, bro. I can run, I forget. Y'all be prepared, bro. Wait, real, real quick, just. Who is it? Nobody's home. I'm gonna real quick check this last door. Cause I swear I heard somebody in here. Nope. Bro, I swear something moved over here. It wasn't the, the basement. Grab this ax, bro. All right, we not pussies. Boo! Who's out here? <sighs> Dearest new resident, congratulations on settling in. You may believe this mansion is your refuge, but every step you take reveals a deeper game. I'm with you in every choice, every move. There's no escape from this inevitable end. What, what does that mean, bro? Every choice, every step. What do you mean by that, my? My God. To be continued, if you enjoyed this game, it would, and it would, if you enjoyed this, imp <laughs> y'all, this game had me, this game, this game had me shivering in my absolute full timbers. My knees was buckled and my feet. My feet were what, bro? I'm, I'm entangled in my brain right now. <laughs> to be continued, if you enjoyed it and would like to support me, please consider wishlisting it on Steam. A horror game made by a solo developer, Corvin Ruler. Corvin, you doing your shit, my boy. You're doing, you're doing, you're doing your thing. You are doing your thing. That shit had me terrified. That whole, that whole entire thing had me scared, bro. The, and, and the thing is the graphics looked good enough for me to be immersed enough. The people looked good. They were different. Y'all. Yo, I'm kinda, I'm not, I'm not even gonna lie, y'all. In a way, I am kinda so flabbergasted in my own brain because of how I felt. And I like scary games, right? The thing is, Heike liking scary games and then being able to play scary games are kind of different. <laughs> nah, yo, I like scary games and I like playing them. And this is exactly the scary game that like, one, I would look forward to playing because every second of me playing this game made me feel scared. Like I couldn't even walk around the house without thinking like, yo, somebody's in the basement waiting for me. Or like, yo, if I turn this car, oh, even first off, bro, 
the first jump scare not expecting him to be behind the counter that surprise factor threw me off so hard like this guy knows what he's doing bro like shout out to this developer bro and thank you for freaking making the game that shit is dope i can't wait to look at more games from this guy and to see this finished product because i feel like i'm going to buy it and play the finished product of this game um but until then i just want to try it out you know what i'm saying this game was good enough for me to feel scared so maybe it's good enough for y'all to watch me get scared right bro i think i dodged at one point i think i went like this did i do that i don't know i don't know i can't remember this this game got me flabbergasted but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed me playing this game i hope you guys enjoyed the game and i hope you guys can go and support corvin corvin ruler bro because this guy knows what he's doing and he's doing a great job doing it but all right y'all that's gonna be it for me you know what i'm saying if you like the video make sure to like the video right if you didn't like the video don't dislike it but don't like it right you already know how it goes i don't got an outro it's just i appreciate you guys clicking on the video Thanks for giving me a shot if it's your first time. If it's a time where you're coming back, I appreciate that as well. Put put down in the comments if you if you're clicking on the video and you're like and you're like, oh, I think I would like to see this guy play this game. Just put it down in the comments. Put down games you guys would like to see me play. In case y'all do have an idea, y'all don't have to. Um, y'all don't have to subscribe either. You know what I'm saying? Y'all y'all don't have to like. Just do whatever y'all want. I do enjoy seeing you guys subscribe and like and, and support the video because it makes me feel like, oh, okay, these guys are liking what I'm doing. You know what I'm saying? I will never force you guys to because it's you know what I'm saying it's all up to you and I'm just doing it for me. Me. and if i can help y'all smile throughout y'all day then that is perfectly fine with me but yeah that is pretty much it but all right y'all let's just end it right there um i hope y'all had a good day you know what i'm saying i hope y'all have a good night i hope y'all have a good day just in case whenever you guys are watching this it doesn't matter just hope you guys have a good night I and mean, i hope you guys have a good life because i said i was gonna say that this week too because i truly do mean it but all right y'all catch you on the next video Make sure to stick around because we're experimenting and we're trying things out but we're having a good time doing it so i can't wait to see y'all next time. Peace out, y'all. Talk to y'all then.